Moving on, Minister in the Presidency, Mwande Gugumbele, says... The president will make a pronouncement in due course. Briefing the media on the outcomes of this week's cabinet meeting earlier, Gugubele says that uh, in light of the report, the president is fine. The president said he will make a pronouncement in due course. I know at times when these developments occur, there's an attempt to make us sound profits in trying to is it fortune telling? <laughs> we, that's the way the president. But the point I want to make, colleagues, up to this point, the president has respected the laws of this country. The president is subjected to this process. Up to this point, we have not seen anything untoward in as far as the laws of the country are concerned. And now he says, I have started the report and I'm still analyzing it. I still stand by my version on certain issues. But I'm ongoingly studying the report, await pronouncements, uh, whatever that's going to be. And uh, where I'm sitting, we've got no doubt, in as far as President's response, suspect for the laws of this country. Remember, this, uh, that, those findings is a report that must be submitted to Parliament, uh, probably depending on the Parliament's decision to kick it other or to call other processes. And you know the meaning of privilege, from Africa. It says at face value, I'm using my own simple language. It appears this has not gone right. Maybe as an elaborate exercise to check further could lead to something. So Prima Africa is, is not a conclusive finding on anything. But it's an indication that there's a need to clarify certain things. So as long as you understand that. But the president says he's starting the report. And he was, we, we expect nothing new. He has respect for the law, something he has demonstrated all over his life. Uh, South Africans are shocked. I, I think South Africans can be shocked if there's a threat to the laws of this country. Usually, I usually say, <clears throat> when laws are threatened, remember what keeps us together in a predictable way, when the laws are kept and adhered to. South Africans are able to go on with their lives because they know as long as those laws are in existence, my life is protected in line with those laws. Whether it's an economic ambition, investment, whether it's a career to pursue, the critical thing, whether it's generations to grow your children, what that is fundamental is the respect for the laws of the country. Fortunately, this president has demonstrated the respect for the laws. The key thing is his adherence and respect for the law.